Hello everyone and welcome back. My name is Kaneb and today I wanted to make a video talking about the iPhone 8. All the features, all the new features, things that they have gotten rid of and obviously some new colours and what colours the iPhone 8 will be shipped when they are released. So let's get started. Number one, we have a new camera design. So with the iPhone 8, it now has a vertical camera. Sort of with the, obviously you have, with the iPhone 7, we have the horizontal camera. We are now having a vertical camera, which I don't know, it, it, it looks pretty cool. We'll have to wait and see what it's gonna actually be like when they are released, but we'll just have to go from that. Number two is that we are actually getting a bigger battery. The way they're doing this is they're actually stacking the chips inside the inside the actual product itself to make room for a larger battery. Obviously, the iPhone's got a decent battery, but it's not spectacular, so I'm expecting a rather large and longer lasting battery. Number three is that we are finally getting wireless charging on the new iPhone 8. This is a pretty major thing for Apple because no, no other products that they have created as, as far have wireless charging. So getting the iPhone 8 to implicate, having, to implicate wireless charging is, is pretty awesome. I'm really looking forward to having a phone that I don't need a case to wireless charge. So yeah. Another point I wanted to make was that there is no home button. This also means that there is no touch ID as as of yet. We don't know if that's sort of gonna gonna be happening in another way. We it's not gonna be implemented into the display itself. So we're not entirely sure how we're going to get the iPhone unlocked unless they're gonna put I don't I don't reckon they put it on the other side like on the back of the phone because every other phone have done that with their touch ID. So I don't think Apple would do that. They'd do something different. But yeah, it's going to be interesting not having a home button, so we'll have to wait and see how that goes. Another point I want to make is that we are getting face ID, like facial recognition for this new iPhone. Specifically with making payments with, with your phone, such as paying for something with PayPal or on the Apple Store, on the App Store or something like that. It's going to be interesting and I feel like it's going to be a lot more secure than using our finger because there's a lot more things to recognize and this would make it a lot more secure in the long run because it's pretty hard to mimic someone else's face. Another major thing with this, the iPhone 8 may be shipped with 4K at 60 FPS capabilities. Now, having that on a phone is pretty major. So I'm really looking forward to seeing how this 4K at 60 frames a second is gonna go on a phone. It's gonna be really interesting to see how this turns out. And last point I wanted to make was that the iPhone will be shipped in three colors, black, silver, and gold. No jet black, no rose gold. I really like jet black, so nothing like that, just those three standard colors. All right guys, if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to leave a like. I wanted to make a quick little video talking about iPhone 8s and the rumors and sort of what we're gonna be getting in the iPhone in the new iPhone next month. So if you want me to do another video of this, I'll do some more research and I'll make another video. I'll probably, I'll more than likely make a video after the Apple Keynote talking about everything and talking about the new products that they're releasing. And yeah, all right guys. And if I'm new to you, don't forget to subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.